Yo, what's going on guys? My name is Karu and welcome back to this brand new video for the 14 days of summer challenges here inside the game. And for this one, I will be showcasing all the locations where you guys can actually go ahead and complete the challenge. Launch fireworks found along the riverbank and we gotta go ahead and launch three of those fireworks but in this exact video i'll be showcasing those three locations but also with that i'll be showcasing some bonus locations because if someone goes ahead before you and uses the firework you guys won't be able to use them so i'll be showcasing all those bonus locations so that you guys won't have any problem completing today's challenge so this is what the free reward is actually going to look like after you complete today's challenge so i'm going to give you guys 10 seconds right now go ahead and drop a like on this video if you guys are excited to unlock this brand new pickaxe and while you're at it do me a favor go ahead and hit that big red button which says subscribe and turn on the notification bell because every time Whenever there's going to be a new Fortnite challenge, I will be helping you guys out with them. And since we're having 14 days of summer challenges, I will be helping you guys out with them every single day as soon as a new challenge is released. So yeah, if you guys want to support me even further, you guys can use my supporter creator code in the Fortnite item shop, which is going to be real dash Garu. So thanks for each and everyone who's using my code. So with that being said, let's jump into today's challenge, which is going to be launch fireworks found along the riverbank. So our first location is actually going to be at Lazy Lagoon. So I want you guys to go ahead and follow this gameplay, what's going on the background right now. Because again, as I've said before, there will be a lot of players shopping over here. And if someone goes there before you, then you guys won't be able to like use the firework and then you guys got to travel a long distance again but anyways this is gonna be our first location so as you guys can see over here there's actually gonna be three boats over here and exactly next to the last boat which is gonna be next to the pirate camp there's gonna be the firework so let me just drop down over here and showcase the exact minimap location where you guys can find this firework for yourself so this is gonna be our first location for the fireworks so i want you guys to pinpoint over here and be precise with this as you guys can see in the minimap as well there's gonna be three little boats over here and from the last one just make a parallel and exactly over there there's gonna be the fireworks so i want you guys to pinpoint over here and glide down as fast as you guys can and use this firework because if you guys have a look at the gameplay this is gonna be the exact place where you guys can find today's firework so you guys can just glide down and take your time and sometimes the firework is gonna reset but it's gonna take a lot of time so we'll be going over to the second location which is super close so don't get confused on this one there's actually gonna be two waterfalls so i want you guys to go over there in that one so let me just go over there and showcase today's fireworks so this is gonna be the exact minimap location where you guys can actually find the second firework which is gonna be pretty close to lazy lagoon so you make sure that you guys are following this video in a complete sequence to save as much time as you guys can and as you guys can have a look at the gameplay from the background this is gonna be the exact place where you guys can actually use the second firework here inside the game i will be showcasing the bonus locations as well so yeah just go ahead and use the firework and the firework is actually going to light up the sky and yeah this is going to be the exact place where you guys can find this firework at this exact x mark spot now once you're you know, done you know using this firework we'll be going over to the third location here inside the game which is going to be super close to this exact place because this one could actually be found at loot lake which is pretty close to lazy lagoon itself and again as i've said before just in case if the firework is not showing up that means someone has already been there before you and used the fireworks so once i'm you know done showcasing the location at loot lake i will be showcasing the bonus locations so that you guys won't have any problems completing this challenge so for this one i want you guys to go ahead and use the slipstream from this place and then move over to the loot lake area where this firework is actually going to spawn next to the rv and this small little truck so uh, as you guys can see over here this is going to be the place where you guys got to drop and this is going to be the exact minimap location so please don't get confused first of all go ahead and pinpoint this place there's going to be this waterfall which is going to flow over here so you guys can just follow the track and pinpoint this first and then just glide down over here and as you guys can see from the gameplay what's going on right now exactly next to the yellow rv there's going to be the fireworks so you guys can come at this exact x mark spot and then use this firework for yourself if this video helps you out please go ahead and drop a like and hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell because every time whenever there's going to be a new fortnite challenge i will be helping you guys out with them and just in case if someone already used the firework at loot lake there's a location which is super close to loot lake so we are just going to go over there to all those bonus locations right now and complete this challenge so i want you guys to go ahead and use the drift boat and go over to neo tilted and exactly next to that there's going to be another firework that you guys can use for yourself and as you guys can see from the gameplay, it's only going to take you just a couple of seconds to reach our fourth location or the bonus location here inside the game. 
And again, after I show you guys the fourth location, I'm gonna showcase the fifth and sixth location as well. So yeah, have a look out for those bonus locations. So as you guys can see over here, there's actually gonna be a small little shed and then there's gonna be this tree. And exactly next to this, there's gonna be the fireworks. So I want you guys to go ahead and pinpoint this exact place where I'm pinpointing right now. Because this will be our bonus location here inside the game and there's like a lot of fireworks on this place as well. But if you guys have a look at the gameplay, what's going on in the background, this is gonna be the exact place where you guys can actually use the firework for yourself. Like the shed is over there, the tree is over there, and exactly next to that tree, there's gonna be the firework. And the reason why I'm saying that, just watch out for the shed just in case if someone goes ahead and destroys the tree. And if you guys are getting confused, where is the firework? Because this is a long stream of water. So please don't get confused. Use the mini map that I showed you guys. And then just glide down over here and complete this challenge. Right now, we'll be going over to the next bonus location, which is super close to this one. So you guys can go ahead and use the drift boat and go near shifty shafts. And it's not even that far. It's only gonna take you like. 10 seconds to you know, reach the next bonus location so as you guys can see over there there's gonna be the snow biome there's gonna be the green biome and exactly next to that tree there's gonna be another firework waiting for you so this is gonna be the exact minimap location where you guys can find the fifth bonus location for the firework here inside the game and as you guys can see over here in the gameplay there's gonna be the snow biome there's gonna be this tree and exactly next to the tree there's gonna be the firework so just go over there and use the firework and interact with it and you guys will be done with this location again you guys gotta come over to this exact tree where i'm you know spray painting right now at this x mark spot and use the firework and it's that simple right now we'll be going over to the next bonus location which could be found in this same route so yeah we are just gonna go over there and showcase that location as well and just in case if you guys don't have a drift board it's okay you guys can actually go ahead and use the slipstream which will be provided exactly over here so yeah that's also another way on how you guys can go ahead and complete this challenge so yeah just go ahead and get inside that slipstream and try to you know, go all the way till the end of the map. Because on this exact slipstream, we can find another firework which could be located next to the orange bridge. Which will be located right over here. So as you guys can see from the gameplay, you guys can drop over here using the slipstream and then use this firework. And once that is done, I want you guys to get back in the slipstream again. Because there will be another location which is going to be super close to this location. So yeah, as soon as you guys pass the orange bridge, I want you guys to go near the factories. Because that will be the exact place where you guys can actually find bonus location. For the firework here inside the game so as you guys can see that there's going to be a passage over here and then there's going to be the factories over there or the dance club and exactly over there there's going to be the firework next to these three trees so yeah this is going to be the exact minimap location where you guys can actually find sixth one and again this is kind of confusing because of the snow biome so please don't get confused and pinpoint at this exact place where i just pinpointed and exactly in between these three trees there's going to be the firework that you guys can go ahead and use and if you guys have a look at the gameplay what's going on in the background right now this will be the exact place where you guys can go ahead and interact with it and complete this challenge and again getting back into the minimap location in between the expedition outpost and the fatal fields you guys can just you know pinpoint these two locations and then kind of you know at the center of it there will be the fireworks so please don't get confused just make sure that you guys are at this exact location where i just spray painted and then use this firework for yourself and just to give you guys a better idea of this location there's gonna be you know that small you know patch of dirt over there which is going all the way till the dance club so yeah you guys can just come over to this exact x mark spot and complete this challenge so the best route that i can give you guys either you guys can start from lazy lagoon and try to you know use that firework over there and then use this one which will be located right over here then you guys can go and use the one which is at loot lake or maybe option two you guys can use this route which will be located over here first so you guys can drop over here and then you know use this one then you guys can go ahead and ride the slipstream and then use the other one which will be located next to shifty shafts at this exact place and then you guys can go ahead and use the firework which will be located next to near tilted next to that shed so you guys can actually go ahead and take all of these three different routes but if you ask me which is going to be the best route for you guys to take i would suggest you guys to go ahead and get the one which is that loot lake take a drift boat or maybe a quad crasher and make all the way till neo tilted Go ahead and use that one because just in case if someone has already used that you guys can have like two different options so you guys can go ahead and use the one which is at shifty shafts and then you guys can go ahead and use this one which will be located next to the factories if you did find this video helpful please go ahead and drop a like and hit that subscribe button because every time whenever there's going to be a new fortnite challenge i will be helping you guys out with them so join the notification squad and yeah once you guys go ahead and complete this challenge will be unlocking this amazing pickaxe and guys completing this challenge is super important because there's going to be another challenge coming up in 14 days of summer where we actually got to go ahead and destroy grills with the low and slow harvesting tool so make sure that you guys go ahead and unlock this pickaxe because we actually got to go ahead 
and you know destroy those grills so if you guys want to complete that challenge you guys got to make sure that you guys complete this challenge first so don't skip on any challenges and these challenges are only going to be there for a limited amount of time so please don't miss out on the challenges there's a lot of free rewards that i've talked about in the past like we are going to get a free back bling once we guys go ahead and complete all the challenges which is going to be the peely banana milkshake back bling and i'm kind of excited for that back bling because we actually saw that in the season 9 trailer itself so i'm kind of excited to see what that bag bling is actually gonna look like let me know which reward are you most excited about because we actually got an emote we got a toy we got emoticons we got spray paint we got a sick wrap we got a pickaxe we got some contrails and for the first time ever we are actually getting a free music pack which is pretty cool in my opinion so let me know what you guys think about all of these 14 days of summer challenges because i personally love them and there's going to be a new challenge coming in tomorrow as well so make sure that you guys have your notifications turned on because as soon as the challenges drop in i will be helping you guys out with them at that exact moment so yeah the reward for tomorrow is going to be crazy i'm not going to spoil it but yeah make sure that you guys tune in tomorrow and yeah my name is Karu. and if you guys need help with the other 14 days of summer challenges then make sure that you guys go ahead and check out this video which is showing up on the screen right now and that's gonna help you out with your challenges and yeah i'm gonna catch y'all in the next video so tell them goodbye and have a great day ahead